Harry painful over King Charles' blunt response to the Duke's Balmoral bag, no longer the Queen's grandson. As we reported, word on the street is that King Charles III and Queen Camilla are gathering a ton of family members at Balmoral Castle on September the 8th to pay tribute to Her Majesty on the first anniversary of her death. And so far, the Duke and Duchess of Sussex haven't snagged an invite, even though they're set to be in the area the next day. Now, a source for page six, who has direct knowledge of the family situation, confirmed the snub is true. Speaking to the outlet on Tuesday, the insider noted the Archwell founders haven't received an information or invite to the plans marking the anniversary of her death. One reason the royal family may not feel pressured to invite their estranged relatives is because, as the source noted, the memorial is not a formal royal event. Looks like Charles found a loophole. So far, Harry has been involved in pretty much every formal event you'd expect him to since leaving London in 2020 such as Elizabeth's funeral and his father's coronation. His involvement ends when he's not considered as family's members anymore. Harry is officially kicked out of the royal inner circle. The source also expressed how personal honouring the Queen would be for every family member. All royal members without Harry and Meghan will attend the cosy family event. Prince Andrew is going to be there and participating in the gathering. It's far better than not getting invited at all. It's clear what Meghan and Harry planned to do. Meghan didn't support, care, or consider the well-being of the Queen when she was alive. So, anything she does will just look so hypocritical, like the Ulvadi trip. She never cared about the Queen, and she still doesn't. She just cares about attention. The Invictus games start on the 9th, so she will perhaps use the 8th to either fly to Germany and fill the press with a lot of pap shots of her arriving. Maybe bring the kids, unlikely. Or she will fly a day or two before and use the 8th for some papped pre-event. Or they will screen Heart of Invictus on Netflix on the 8th. It's no surprise the Harry and Meghan stars are being left out of the guest list, but what's more bitter for Harry is that he no longer is considered a member of the family. The distance between him and his family has widened. A royal expert has claimed that the removal of Prince Harry's His Royal Highness title is a sign that there is no doubt he's out of the royal inner circle. The Duke and his wife Meghan Markle have also been moved toward the bottom of the list of royals on the royal family tab. Expert Robert Jobson believes that the move is just another example of the king allowing the dust to settle. There's zero communication between father and son. He's made enemies of William and Camilla, even Catherine, Jobson told the Express. If Harry was in any doubt he was out, that website update has left him in no doubt. The move to strip them, or technically not allow usage of, the Sussex title was right. It wasn't vindictive, just clear, proper, and right. It's a little slow, but that's the palace for you, and all this newfangled technology.